Long before Josh Taylor and Jason Pretty were taking the field with the Diamondbacks in spring training, they were D-backs fans. And like many fans, their first memory of the team isn't a surprising one. Probably, probably the World Series, to be honest, because I mean, I mean, it's a big one, but I just remember Game 7 at my dad's best friend's house, and everyone was just going crazy. Uh, obviously, the World Series win was a huge thing. Um, you know, anytime a team wins a World Series, that's big. For the Prescott born pretty, that memory was replaced at the top of his list when he took the field against his childhood favorite team. I actually got my first hit off the Diamondbacks in the big leagues and my first home run off the Diamondbacks in the big leagues when I was in New York. So that was kind of a cool thing to uh, have that against your hometown team. Being a part of a major league camp is exciting for any baseball player, but for Taylor and Pretty, putting on this cap is a childhood dream come true. I mean, it's what I grew up wishing to do, you know, like playing on this field and playing with, you know, with this logo on my chest and being able to represent them. So, I mean, every day I come out here, I'm just grateful for the opportunity to be able to represent the Diamondbacks. Taylor arrived via a trade with the Phillies in 2015, the only franchise he knew to that point. For Pretty, the D-backs are his seventh club in nine years. Well, this is a team you want to play for. This is my 16th year and finally be able to put the uniform on, it's a pretty good feeling. Um, you know, I hope I hope I can you know, put it on for another couple years before I, before I stop playing. Taylor and Pretty are both non-roster invitees this spring, so even if they don't make the roster, they both said they're enjoying being home for as long as they can.